Hey, so, I firstly, I want to talk about Roman Grout. It's actually really, really, really strong. He's really, like, right by the sea. And, like, you know how most things, like, when regular concrete or grout, when it get hit by seawater, it, like, it disintegrates away. But Roman Grout is made with seawater, the mineral, uh, the lime, but mineral, and volcanic ash. So when the seawater hits it, it just makes it stronger. Is that Roman lime right there? Or Roman grout? We think it is, but in the 1930s, they might have just patched it over with. Whatever they used in 1930. Yeah. And where are you? In Albania. Come on. I didn't see you there. Today I'm in an old Roman church. Wait, Roman? Uh, um, no. The Romans didn't build it. Well, uh, I'm in an old church built in the 6th century. Mm -hmm. So this is the church. It doesn't have any rooms. This is made out of wood. Everything just rotted away. So, yeah. So then... So that we're in this like uh, forest preserve, but it's like not a forest preserve. It's like a um, like a, a museum. Not recommended for kids, except there's a lot of sticks to wax up with. It's an old Roman city. Yeah, we're in an old Roman city, except this isn't built by the Romans. So, yeah. Oh no, so I already got a hornet, a bee, and a king bee, which are like this big. Well, actually bigger, like like a little bit smaller than this. Than this. Like, like, yeah. And then also I've seen a couple of hornets. So these, I think, we like use for like putting wood in. Okay. And then like the that it would be like that. They'll hold the briefs off. Hmm. Oh, and also like and subscribe.